Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to see exercise 4.3 problems. First one, name three pairs of vertically opposite angles in the figure. If angle AOB equals to 45, then find angle DOE. Okay, so here two parts are there. First of all, we have to write the pairs, vertically opposite angle pairs. First pair, C, AOB and this, DOE, angle AOB, angle DOE. Next, second way, these two completed, na? now these two, AOF, COD. angle C O D and next we can write these two B O C E O F angle B O C angle E O F okay so one by two three pairs that's it problem they are giving angle A O B as 45 degrees so angle AOB and we want to find out angle DOE. So angle AOB equals to angle DOE. Why these two are vertically opposite angles? So vertically opposite angles are equal. So they both are equal. So finally angle DOE also 45 degrees. Second problem. In the given figure, PQ is a strike line. Here, this PQ is a strike line. Check whether X and Y are vertically opposite angles or not. Give a reason. So, ikada X, Y and A two angles which are kada, are vertically opposite or taya leda. What is the reason? Okay. So, that is the question. So, before solving this, first just recall what is vertically opposite angle. So, when two lines intersect, the lines must be like this. Right? So, PQ is a line and but SR is not a strike line if you observe. So, first of all, these two are not intersecting lines. Intersecting lines are either any other than vertically opposite angles form a body. So, X and Y are not vertically opposite angles because PQ and S are, are not intersecting lines. Okay. So, X and Y are not vertically opposite angles. Reason PQ is a strike line, but SR is not a strike line. If PQ and SR are intersecting lines, X and Y becomes vertically opposite angles okay so third problem write any three examples for vertically opposite angles in your surroundings so we can write scissors window grills with crossbars crossroads and rail cross junctions okay so these are the examples of vertically opposite angles fourth problem in the given figure the lines L and M intersect at a point P. Okay. So here L and M are intersecting at a point P. Now observe the figure and find the values of X, Y and Z. Okay. So now just observe this figure. So here X and Z are vertically opposite angles. And this Y and 20 are also vertically opposite opposite angles. So, we can write now y equals to 20 degrees. y vertically opposite angles. Vertically opposite angles are equal. Na? So, they are equal. So, next similarly x is equal to z. They are also vertically opposite angles. Now, again come to the figure. See, this L line 
ഈ എൽ ലൈന് ദിസ് എക്സ് ആൻഡ് വൈ ഈ ടു ആംഗിൾസ് തോ ഈ ലൈൻ അനേരി ഫോം ആയി നിൽക്കുന്നത് റൈറ്റ് സോ വി കെൻ സേ ദേ ആർ ലിനിയർ പേ x plus y equals to 180 y they are linear pair because they are forming a line okay so what is x we don't know but we know y na y 20 degrees equals to 180 x is equal to 180 so manaki y y telusu kabatti y substitute chesamo and e plus 20 ni manam transpose chesina appudu minus out on the so x is equal to 160 degrees so what is x here 160 degrees so x is equal to z now so z also equals to 160 degrees and we already calculated y y equals to 20 degrees fifth problem in the given figure two lines AD and EC intersect at O. Name two pairs of vertically opposite angles in the given figure. Here, just manali confused shade and cause me numbers each not low. Okay, actually the numbers also remain low. See, in the given figure, EC and AD are intersecting lines. Okay, so intersecting lines I will do. So, 1 ki 3, opposite ka unne kada. So, what is 1, A, this is O, A, O, E. A, O, E and C, O, D. These are vertically opposite angles. First by, okay? and second one this angle these two angles EOD angle EOD and angle AOC okay so like this you can write or in numbers code I am use cheyali ane ante angle 1 equals to angle 3 first one these two are vertically opposite and next these two are vertically opposite angles this total angle angle 4 plus angle 5 so we can write as angle 2 equals to angle 4 plus angle 5 ok either this or this you can write anything sixth problem the last problem of this exercise two lines PS and QT intersect at Yam. PS and QT lines are intersecting at point Yam. Observe the figure and find X. Okay. So, first just observe this figure. This PS and QT are intersecting at this point. Na? So, this angle, this, these two are opposite angles and these two are also opposite. So, they are called vertically opposite. So, from figure we can write angle PMQ is equal to angle TMS. Reason vertically opposite angles. So vertically opposite angles are equal. So that's why these two are equal. And what is another pair? QMS. Angle QMS is equal to PMT. Same reason, vertically opposite angles. What is this QMS? This part and this part. It don't need to be any color. QMS and a total angle form out of the. So that implies angle QMS. Okay, first we'll write angle QMS is equal to angle QMR plus RMS. So what is angle QMR? 40 plus RMS X. So that implies QMS means now we can write 40 degrees plus X is equal to what is angle PMT? 
105 degrees. Okay. So we can write here I will P M T equals to 105. So X is equal to 105 degrees minus 40. So 100 minus 40 is 60. And 5 is there now. So it is 65. So what is the value of X here? X is equal to 65 degrees. So this is exercise 4.3. So I think you understand these problems students. Please like this video and please share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.